Hi guys, Roman Field, two hours. It ain't giving up much now, but we're gonna give it a go. So uh, these, these digs, short and sweet, just gonna show the clips. Um, I'm, it's after work, I'm tired. So yeah, let's do it. See you at the first, hopefully. Guys, right, so first find, been about 20 minutes. It's a Roman, a bit grotty. I'll be able to clean him up. There you go, nice first find. On to the next. No, saying. I reckon that's another piece of lead. Okay, so I'm in the uh, getting close to the hot spot again. There's uh, when I was finding Roman coins and stuff. There's lots of lead around. Okay, let's keep going. Hopefully, we'll hit the good stuff soon. Right, next up, solid 77. Now, I know it's out the hole somewhere. There we go. What we got? Oh, oh that's, I didn't expect that to be a Roman here. This is where the trash normally is. Look at that, guys. Let's get you in the light. That's a rather large Roman coin. Strange between a bow with me. Sorry about the wind, guys. It's a little bit windy here today. Oh, lovely. That's a very large Roman coin. Fantastic. Look at that. Near 2,000 years, it was dropped, and then we couldn't find it all these years later. Now, I don't know who that is. Could be a Constantius with a little ponytail there. Not sure. I'll find out later, and I'll let you know in the roundup. Fantastic. Great start. Check this out. What lovely condition for a George V. 1918, one penny. That's quite really mint that has. Especially on an arable field. That's lovely. On to the next one, guys. All right, just took this plug. <whistles> on this occasion, just lead. All right, guys, always a good reminder to check your holes when you filled them. It wasn't just a bit of lead. That's the signal I was actually getting. So yeah, when I put the pinpointer in, I must have been chasing that lead around the hole. Let's give it a wipe. Okay. Looks like there might be some, yeah, some detail on there. It's one of those ones which is gonna need a little bit of, a little bit of water. Clearly see. That is definitely a Roman. Alright. 20 minutes, two Roman coins. Not bad. Let's keep going. Oh, this isn't hard to miss. What have we got? Let's have a look. Well, this one's seen better days, I reckon. 1860 something. So that's going to be Victoria. Yeah, just see her coming through. It's a Victoria Penna, but been pretty well beat up that one. On to the next, guys. Right, next signal. I think it's going to be a brooch or a fragment. Let's have a look. I think that's a small, is that a small rosette brooch? I think that is. I won't mess about with that too much at the moment. That could be quite early. That could be, uh, I found a couple on here previously. That could be um, late Iron Age. So we're looking at like 30 to 60 AD. Quite early those. Tiny that one. So there's some mud in there. Yeah, well we're certainly on it. It's been about 20 minutes since the last signal, so things are going quiet on this field now, but it's still worth being patient. Right, hopefully we'll find some more. Check this out, people. This gave an iron tone with a, just a slight ping, and it was in the 
high 30s, low 40s, so I wasn't going to dig it. But you know when you just get that nice signal on a Roman site, you just think, even just the faintest of signals. Can you focus from it? There we go. Now I saw the back bit, so there's a pin straight away. It's obviously a brooch of some kind. Mm, looks very fragile. I don't think I mess with it too much. What kind of brooch is that though? Is that another one of those? It's not Rosetta, is it? What's that? Is that a Rosette brooch? I think it might be actually. Let me see if I can zoom this in a bit for you. Yeah, I think that's another rosette brooch. I've had one before, actually. They're early. They're, um, I think, 30 to 60 AD. That's a really cracking, that's a cracking find. I'm surprised at the signal as well. So I'm just now starting to question what else have I decided not to do. Okay, cool. On to the next. Uh, this one, just dug it. Yeah, it's giving me 90, so. Every time I do a live dig, lead. Potentially that's a pop. Yeah, that's a pop mend. Uh, still lead though. Every time I do <laughs> a live dig. Anyhow, on to the next. Seen it. Bit of lead. Looks like it was something. Maybe a foot. Who knows? On to the next. Live digs. The one I didn't do a live dig on. Looks like a Roman to me. Let's have a look. Oh, that's a beauty. Oh, nice. Might even be the last find of the day because I'm actually uh, just about to clock off and head home. What an absolute beauty. It's quite a big one as well. Oh, I think I've found one of these before. It's like a Magnentius or Maxentius. I'll get that cleaned up when I get back. What a cracking find. What a beauty. I'm not sure the date on that, but I think it's like 360, something like that. 360 AD, I'll say, as a guess. Right, on to the next. Hopefully, hopefully we'll find one more thing on the way to the car.